What's going on guys? It is Anthony and yes, it is the Run Start Experiment. Today we are out here at the beautiful Aklutna Lake. We are once again getting out so you're gonna wanna stay tuned. Look at today's All right, so one of my last videos was us out at the Hatcher's Pass. Um, absolutely beautiful landscape. So on Saturdays, I am attempting to get the kids out, uh, getting myself out with uh, the gear, starting to take, oops, starting to take more photos with the Canon and with my cell phone and more videos. And a part of that uh, comes from getting out and doing stuff just like this so we've been out here for like 45 minutes an hour it's a little chilly earlier but now the sun is coming out but like just look at this so on the wrenched out garage and if you ever visit here you can uh camp on this side but you can actually drive all the way back in there if you have a side-by-side -side or a four-wheeler which is a beautiful beautiful easy ride but this time of year it is just absolutely stunning especially when the winds are down the water looks like glass it just uh it's beautiful to get out here it's also obviously good to get out um and do things but again i'm trying to trying to use the cameras more trying to shoot more videos and to me there's nothing better than loading up uh getting out with the kids so they can run around and play um, but so we all can enjoy a view just like this we did just get snow that's what you're seeing here snow starting to come down the mountains um which means winter's coming sooner than later the frost has been thick i did get the drone up for a few moments uh this location i'm kind of limited because i was actually shooting with the drone past this tree line there's a little bit of a, a opening and which is fine the problem is is once i start getting the drone out over to here i can't see it from there obviously i can put it up here i am limited under faa regulation for flight height because there are some planes flying around today um so generally in that sense just so you know and just so i'm clear uh, when I fly a drone and I know like this area has some recreational flying uh, that they come over this way, they go to this, I believe some of them even go to the glaciers on the other side. Um, generally, I stay pretty close to the tree lines because I know or hope that an aircraft isn't flying uh, that close to the tops of the tree line. So that's what I, I attempt to do and I would recommend that if you are gonna fly, don't get into their airspace. Obviously, you don't wanna re be responsible for any kind of damage or anything. Um, pretty, pretty busy here this morning though, I will say that, but it's also absolutely beautiful. So some cool stuff is A, obviously I'm getting back out and I'm gonna just start shooting a lot more photos a lot more videos and everything else but little adventures like this getting the opportunity to get the kids out to enjoy some time with them enjoy the beautiful scenery uh put start putting the gear to the the test i got the canon aed with the uh, 10 to 18 mil lens on it this is uh, i do need to still get that replacement filter the nd filter because i can't shoot very clear photos without a filter so i do need to get a replacement for that but really just even being out here right now i mean like look at the color look at just absolutely stunning um the office i believe at this point by the time you're seeing this video i should have released uh the preliminary office video or studio or whatever i'm going to dub it at some point that's coming along uh great it's also starting to uh that side of it is also encouraging creativity and uh the ability to i guess with the new office too is the ability to be able to get stuff done faster quicker better and everything of the sort that's uh gonna wrap it up for me today guys another short and sweet video 
Um, we're going to do, hopefully I'll be able to get to a point of doing some tutorials and we'll get out um, more in a tracking pattern. We're quite a, quite a bit far from the, the vehicles at this moment, but it's all through the woods, so not super exciting to see. But this is, again, a clue in the lake. I appreciate everybody that's stopping by. Uh, hopefully throughout this video or at the end of the videos also check the check out the very ends of these videos because i do try to put some uh, video and some photos that i took during these trips and of course check us out on instagram and facebook because i also post a lot of the photos from these trips there as well hope you guys enjoyed the video as always hit the subscribe button the like button share the content and we'll catch up with you in the next video all right so for you in this video Walking back, we went through the woods to go down there. I did not know you're not supposed to have drones here. So, I apologize for breaking that rule. Don't use drones at a food the lake. I, uh, again, we walked off on the side. Didn't see any of the signs posted. So, that's it. That's all I got. Broke some rules today. Again, thank you guys for tuning in. See you in the next video. It's also quite cold now.